Did you know that Einstein's general theory of relativity revolutionized our understanding of space, time, and gravity? This groundbreaking theory, introduced to the world in 1915, was the brainchild of Albert Einstein, a notion so powerful it proposed that massive objects actually warp the fabric of space-time. Imagine that! The universe as we know it, its very structure, influenced by the mass and energy within it. But Einstein didn't work alone on this monumental theory. He collaborated with his friends and colleagues, Marcel Grossman and Michel Basso. Together, they explored the depths of this revolutionary concept, delving into the mysteries of the cosmos and our place within it. This theory was a game changer, but did you know that the early version contained a major error? Yes, you heard it right. The early version of Einstein's revolutionary theory had a significant error. Einstein, like any great scientist, was not infallible. His initial draft of the general theory of relativity contained a miscalculation, but this error didn't go unnoticed. With the help of his colleagues, notably Marcel Grossman and Michel Basso, Einstein corrected the mistake before the theory's final publication in 1916. This refined theory, free of the initial error, was a true scientific marvel. Now corrected, the theory was ready for the world, but its acceptance wasn't immediate. It was not until 1919 that Einstein's theory gained international fame. The limelight fell on the general theory of relativity, thanks to British physicist Arthur Eddington. Eddington embarked on a mission to confirm Einstein's groundbreaking theory during a solar eclipse. The eclipse provided the perfect conditions to test one of the theory's key predictions, that light from stars would be bent as it passed the sun. Eddington's venture was no small feat. It was a time when the world was emerging from the shadows of the Great War. Yet, Eddington and his team journeyed to the island of Principe off the West African coast and to Sobral in Brazil. They captured images of the stars around the sun during the solar eclipse and compared them to their regular positions. The results were astounding. The star's light had indeed curved around the sun, just as Einstein's theory had predicted. The news hit headlines worldwide. It was a triumphant moment for the general theory of relativity, catapulting it from the realms of scientific discussion to global recognition. Einstein's theory was now world-renowned, but not without controversy. Einstein faced accusations of plagiarism from mathematician David Hilbert. Quite a bold claim, isn't it? Hilbert, a contemporary of Einstein, had also been working on the theory of relativity. However, historical analysis tells a different tale. Careful studies have shown that Einstein's work on the theory was independent and distinct. The two brilliant minds were on parallel paths, yes, but they were not intersecting. Despite these accusations, Einstein's theory stood strong, and its real-world implications were yet to be discovered. Evidence of general relativity in action such as gravitational waves was not confirmed until the 1960s. But what an exhilarating confirmation it was. The existence of gravitational waves was a direct prediction of Einstein's theory. These elusive ripples in space-time were finally detected by the LIGO and Virgo observatories in 2015. And it didn't stop there. Another evidence supporting general relativity was the bending of light around massive objects, a phenomenon known as gravitational lensing. This was first observed during a solar eclipse in 1919, where the star's positions appeared to shift due to the sun's gravitational pull. Other tests have included precise measurements of the orbit of Mercury, which deviates from Newtonian predictions in a way that is accurately accounted for by general relativity. So, while it took a few decades, the evidence for Einstein's theory of general relativity piled up, affirming its validity and altering our understanding of the universe. But let's not forget, Einstein's theory was not just a theoretical physics marvel, it had practical applications too. Uh, Einstein's theory has contributed to everyday technologies like GPS. You see, the general theory of relativity, with its intricate understanding of space, time, and gravity, has practical applications that extend far beyond the realm of theoretical physics. It's inextricably woven into the fabric of our daily lives. Take for example, the global positioning system or GPS, a technology that's become almost indispensable. When you use a GPS device, it calculates your exact position by timing the signals sent by GPS satellites high above the Earth. But here's the twist. These satellites are so far away, and their clocks tick so fast compared to those on Earth, that if we didn't account for the effects of relativity, our GPS coordinates would be off by several kilometers. Einstein's theory allows us to correct for this discrepancy, 
ensuring that our GPS devices can pinpoint our location with remarkable accuracy. Without the general theory of relativity, we might still be fumbling with paper maps and compasses. So the next time you use your GPS to find your way, remember that it's all thanks to a revolutionary theory presented over a century ago. Einstein's general theory of relativity continues to shape our understanding of the universe and influence the technology we use every day.